How do you guys determine aircraft weight accurately enough to calculate parameters like fuel? Uh, how do you account for carry-ons, passenger weight, etc.? That's a great question. Um, there's a lot of factors that go into the weight of an aircraft for takeoff and landing and all those things. So they do it through a variety of different measures. Back in my Navy days, we kind of did it by hand. It's much more scientific these days. For instance, fuel. Most jet fuel that most airliners take is somewhere in the vicinity of six and a half pounds per gallon. So they'll come up with the exact weight per gallon, how many gallons you put into the airplane. That's the fuel calculation. They do a general calculation for passengers. That weight calculation goes up by the time of year. In the winter time, they add about eight pounds because you carry more things with you, you carry heavier coats and so forth, and you tend to put on a little weight in the winter, okay? So that all gets factored in. On top of all that, they have a certain amount of weight for the bags. They actually, when the bags go and get checked in, they actually do get weighed. And then your carry-on bags, they count how many carry-on bags go on. I have been bumped off a flight before as a jump seater because after they did the final carry-on bag count, they didn't have enough leftover space for me to get on the airplane. That's the way it works. So they put all that in. Then there's a fudge factor on top of all of that. Uh, to make sure that you don't even get close. Most of my normal flights are well under any sort of uh, parameter that might be close to a weight restriction. I have lots of power to spare, but that's, that's really a great question.